welcome back to the channel everyone today i have for you a haul video this is my haul video for may um this is my second time filming this i have been having some issues with my camera one that i thought i had fixed and now it seems like there is something else going on <sighs> i swear if it isn't one thing it's another but we are gonna try to get this filmed. I am talking kind of low and I am at a different location from my desk because my husband is sleeping and he has to get up really early in the morning. So I'm trying not to be too loud. Um, I have a few things to show you. Most of it is books. Um, there are two or three things that are not books that I have here. So let's go ahead and get into those first. So the first thing I have is this pink rose case here. Um, I needed a new case for my Shabir Farbins. I didn't like the case that they were in. So I ordered this and did a little bit of rearranging with my pencils. So those are actually not the pencils that are in here. These are my Mitsubishi pencils that are in here. But this is the new case and I really like it. I do have the blue one I think it is of this. Um, they have a few other colors that I'll probably end up getting if I get any more pencils, which I do plan. Right, so there is that. The other thing that I got finally was um, a cloud stencil. I've been needing one for a long time now. And I finally got one. And I do have a page to share with you in my completed pages video for May that I did use this on. And I really like how it came out. So you guys will see that soon. The other thing that I got that is not a book is um, Pamela's Passion for Pencils now has an Etsy shop. And she has this for sale. This is a um, combination worksheet. It is for three color blends. And it's less than $2 and I printed, I bought it and printed a bunch of these and got some new color combos that I'm actually using right now. So um, I definitely recommend this if you're somebody that likes to keep track of color combinations and all that stuff. All right, now we're gonna get into the books. The first one I have here is I Love Unicorns or I Heart Unicorns. These little ones I will not be doing full flip throughs of. So um, I will just show you some images in here. Right, there's that one. And then I also got I Heart Koalas. I think um, koalas would be a really cute addition to Lulu Mayo's A Million series. I would definitely get a, the um, A Million Koalas if she did one. The next book I have is Colorful Celebrations holidays and festivals around the world by color it this is their new book there is already a full flip through of this on my channel so i will just show you a few pages here a lot of these are landscape um, it would be really nice if it color it in their books would do all the landscapes together and then all the portraits together, but it is what it is. The next three are, um, I believe a series. The first one is Journey to the Secret Library. These are double-sided um, pages, or at least that's what it said. I would consider them single-sided because they are... Um, the backs of all of them are blank. So even though here it looks like a double page spread or two, both of them on the back are blank and all of them are like that. 
so you can definitely use alcohol markers in these ones um if you would like to see a full flip through of this or any of the other books that i show just leave a comment below and i will do my best to get that flip through film for you the next one in that series is Wings of journey to the whimsical garden Last one is a journey to the mysterious island. The next two I have here are not coloring books but they are activity books or i don't know what you would really call them um, but they are paint by sticker books this one is the masterpieces so it has um, a bunch of famous paintings in it i have already done one of them and i will show that in my completed pages for may video Other one I have is paint by sticker travel. So this one has apparently a bunch of um, old fashioned travel posters or something. And I just got this one today, so I haven't done anything in it yet. The next book I have is Grazia Salvo's Wild Soul. I'm really excited to have this in my collection. When I went to get the hardcover um, edition, they were sold out on Amazon. And um, when I seen that they brought out the soft cover one, I decided to go ahead and grab it because I really, really have been wanting this for a long time now. And I'm just glad to have some version of it in my collection. This one here is Intricate Ink Animals in Detail, Volume 5 by Tim Jeffs. I will be doing a full flip through of this one. This is his newest volume, I believe. I don't believe there is a six yet. This is my first book of his, and depending on how I like it, I may get the other ones as well. The next one I have, I saw on Jen's video from Coloring with Pugs. This is the Tim Burton coloring book. It has um, six movies, Beetlejuice, The Nightmare Before Christmas, Edward Scissorhands, Corpse Bride, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, and Alice in Wonderland. I think there might be another one in here, another movie, but I'm not sure because I haven't seen all of them. Um, so, yeah, but I will be doing a full flip through of this, so keep look out, look out for that. The next one I have is the new coloring book cafe, Japanese Gardens. Um, I was able to pick this up the first few days that it was released, so it was 50% off. And I will be doing a full flip through of this one also. The next two are Creative Haven. The first one is Trees of Life. And I will be having full flip throughs of this one. The other one is Cheerful Inspirations Laugh More, Worry Less. 
I wanted this one um, a lot's been going on the last month so I thought that on the days where I'm not feeling too nice or like, feeling sad or whatever that coloring one of these might help because they are chill full inspirational quotes so there's that one the other one i have is floating island by coco Weil. i really like this book um it seems very unique although it does remind me of mysterious planets which is another book i really like I will be doing a full flip through of this one. This here is another book that I saw on Jen's haul. This one is Color and Ocean's Mermaids. And I will probably be doing a full flip through of this one also. There's some really cute pictures in there. Then I got Maria Choi's Newborn Luna. I don't know if I will be doing a flip through of this one or not. I still um, haven't decided on that. I have to give this one a little bit of thought. that one then I got Disney princesses spirals dots and lines um, so in some of these books you can't tell who they are until you actually do it in this one you can you can in person I'm not sure if it comes through um, on the camera or not but in person you can kind of see who they are like this one is Pocahontas this is Ariel, uh, this is Jasmine, and I did do one and I will be showing that in my completed pages video. Then I got this Disney Villains Spiroglyphics. This one you cannot see who they are until you actually complete the, the spiral. Um, but I did do one and I will be showing that in my video. Um, but here's the back, and you get Cruella de Vil, Captain Hook, Ursula, Jafar, and Maleficent are just some of the ones you get. Um, this one was actually the first one. I had never done one of these, and I did my first one here and decided to go ahead and get the Disney Princesses one. Um, it was different, but I actually kind of liked it. I'm not sure I did it correctly. It might have come out a little wonky, but... I would continue to do them until I learned how to do them correctly. And then the last one is just this one here, Care Bears Coloring Book. I used to love the Care Bears and um, I saw this and decided to pick it up. It does not have that brown um, paper that's in children's coloring books. It is just a regular crate space paper though. All right, that is the last thing I had to share with you guys. Um, I will be having my completed pages for the month of May video coming soon. A bunch of flip throughs should be coming. I um, should also be having the TMI 50 questions video coming at some point um, in June. So keep an eye out for those videos. If you like this one, please give it a thumbs up, but consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.